Kashmir. Kashmir has produced many saints, poets and mystics. Among them, Lal Dev is very prominent. In Kashmir, some people consider her a poet, some consider her a holy woman, and some consider her a Sufi, a yogi, and a devotee of Shiva. The sayings of Lal Dev are echoed in the hearts of every Kashmiri around the world. Lal Dev was a rebel saint, a revolutionary mystic of the 14th century Kashmir. The world only knows Lal Dev through her verses called Wak that have come down to us through folk tradition of Kashmir. Raleshwari was born in Pandrathan, about 4.5 miles to the southeast of Srinagar, in a Kashmiri Pandit family during the time of Sultan Alauddin. She was married at the age of 12, but her marriage was an unhappy one. She left home at the age of 24 to take sannyas and become a disciple of Shaivitya Guru. The leading Kashmiri Sufi figure, Sheikh Nuruddin Wali, also known as Nandrishi, was highly influenced by Lal Dev. One Kashmiri folk story recounts that as a baby, Nandrishi refused to be breastfed by his mother. It was Lal Dev who breastfed him. She did not think in terms of men and women. She would claim that she had yet to encounter a man, and that is why she went about naked. But when she saw Shah Hamdan, she hid herself. I saw a man, I saw a man, she said. Now the question is, why is Lal Dev so famous in Kashmir? She was illiterate, she was wise. That's a contradiction. Her sayings are full of wisdom. In these sayings, she dealt with everything from life. Yoga, God, from Dharma to Atma. Her riddles are on the lips of every Kashmir. The exact date of Lal Dev's death is not known. It is claimed that she died in Bij Bihara. People like Bob Lala do not really die. Lal Dev is alive in her sayings and in the hearts of Kashmiris. People of Kashmir know Lal Dev from her sayings which have passed from generations to generation with her great philosophical sense. When one interprets them, it's impossible to say that they were written by somebody who was a normal woman without a spiritual power. These qualities have made Lal Dev immortal for centuries and she is living on the sayings which have passed to us through our forefathers. She is a part and parcel of Kashmiri's rich and cultural heritage. <laughs>